You are watching Slipstream's Clean Energy Career video series. The state of Wisconsin, along with many cities, counties, businesses, and utilities are charting a pathway to 100% carbon-free electricity by 2050. Hydropower, generated by flowing water, is one of the oldest sources of energy. Humans have been harnessing the power of water for centuries to grind grain, drive sawmills, and move water for crop irrigation. Today, we will talk to employees of Excel Energy to learn more about their jobs in hydroelectricity. My name is CJ Chrisman. I am a hydro operator for Excel Energy at the Cornell Hydro Facility. My name is Nolan DeBruzzi. I'm a generation system operator for Excel Energy at the Wasota Hydro Plant. Tell us about your career path. So I started right out of high school. I took an entry level job with Excel Energy as a meter eater. I worked in that job for five years until I was hired on at the Allen S. King Generating Station. I worked at King Plant for eight years, seven of which were in the operating department where I eventually got into the control room operator position. I really liked my career from there, but I realized that Excel Energy was moving towards a clean, renewable future, which coal plants aren't a part of. So I wanted to transition into the green energy field. So I applied for the hydro operator position, and here I am today. After high school, I joined the U.S. Navy. I got out of the Navy after my term and applied for a job at the Allen S. King plant in Bayport, Minnesota. I started there a little over seven years ago, and I moved up to be a plant equipment operator in the control room at the King plant. And then a year and a half ago, I took a generation systems operator position here at Hydro, Wisconsin. Describe a day on the job. My position as a generation systems operator, we remotely monitor and operate 19 hydro plants, 65 generators with a capacity of 270 megawatts. In our job, we oversee our critical systems at each facility. We write up notifications for work that may be broken. We talk to our managers and the rest of our hydro team to coordinate work to be done so that we can have a successfully running hydro plant. What's exciting to you about a job in clean energy? It's good carbon-free power that's reliable. It's been here for 100 years. It's gonna be here 100 years from now. It's great technology that we just keep improving on and it's gonna be here far into the energy future. What was your education like? The highest level of education that I have is a high school diploma. I have a high school education followed by my experiences gained in the Navy and from that with several power plant fundamental courses and other courses given through our apprenticeships we were trained through on-the-job training to perform our duties. What are three skills that are necessary for a career in clean energy? Three skills that would be needed to perform this position would be good problem-solving skills, being detail-oriented, and the ability to handle high-stress situations. Three skills that are needed in this profession are communication, mechanical aptitude, and general computer skills. Communication is huge because on our jobs, we have to be able to communicate what the issue is, how to resolve that issue, and lock it out safely. The mechanical aptitude is very important because these are a lot of systems doing one thing, so it's good to know how they can all tie together. In the basic computer skills, I mean, you're sending emails all the time, you're making spreadsheets, you're updating charts. It is very important to have basic computer skills for this job. What classes should high school students think about taking now? Classes that high school students should take are your technical courses, your tech eds, there's carpentry classes, if there's welding classes, anything trade oriented, because that is really what this field is about. Anything hands-on, mathematics, any sciences to do with the operation of pumps, oil systems, power plants are full of all different systems and we need to know how they run. Why do you recommend that high school students get involved in a clean energy career? I think high school students should get involved in clean energy careers because that is the way a lot of power companies are going. The clean energy sector jobs has jumped drastically since even 2005. That just goes to show that you're going to have a job available for you in the clean energy sector. The job stability 
in this career is great. We're always going to need electricity and what better to go to work on a river every day. Are you interested in learning more about clean energy careers in Wisconsin? Take a look at the other videos in this series.